how do you remember the news when you found out that you are going to be Miss Golden Globe? Well, that's almost 60 years ago, so this is a big stretch here. I was under contract to MGM Studios, and they would inform me of the things that I was going to be doing. And they said I was going to be doing the Golden Globes. I knew that was a prestigious award show. So I was excited about it. Uh, I didn't know what to expect because I'd never seen one or been to one. And in those days, they weren't on television. But I had high expectations of seeing everyone in Hollywood and being a part of a big night. And I thought that was wonderful. Do you remember what you were wearing? Not, not at all. And if they can't even find a picture of me, <laughs> it was lovely that MGM did my hair and makeup and dressed me. So I didn't have to be responsible for any of that. And who was your date? <laughs> no, this was a job. <laughs> I went home right after we finished the event. Uh, I didn't have a date. I don't remember a lot of details about it uh, because I was backstage a lot and only came out when I was presenting an award. But of course, I was nervous. I was young. I had never done anything like that. And I was excited to look out and see all the wonderful people I loved in the films. They were so excited when they got the award. We hardly said a word because the press took them, they went, they did. And I certainly would never have thought on that night that I would one day receive one myself. It's a tie. Barbara Bel Geddes and Linda Evans. like it's a dream. Uh, I was the Golden, Miss Golden Globes in 1963, handing these to people. Let's go to 1981, when you actually won. It was a totally different experience. You're absolutely right. Um, Nolan Miller did do my gown. Of course, it would have been exciting even if I hadn't won, because the Golden Globes were done so beautifully because they had the tables and the flowers and the wine and the champagne and everyone was close, but you had your group with you. And it was festive and it was exciting and people would stop and say, how are you? And talk to you about the show and you would talk to them. So it was a very exciting night all around. I really enjoyed the Golden Globes every time I was there. You share a birthday with the Golden Globes. You're both going to be 80 years young. All right. What is your birthday advice and birthday wish to the Golden Globes on its 80th? Well, may it go another 80 years or more. Uh, and may I go another 80 years or more. And my wish is that the world gets happier. There's a lot of peace on earth and in our hearts. It's now we're tuned in to everyone in the entire world having the same problems that we're having and realize that we just want to help each other and make this a happier, better world. I'm just very happy. Thank you very much. <laughs> 